Good morning, little spirits. It's Sunday, January 30th. Welcome. It is the fourth Sunday in Ordinary Time. I hope you've had a fun week and I look forward to talking to you about our story in the gospel today. Well, before we get started, let's look at this picture. We see, of course, this is Jesus. And what do you think Jesus is doing? Oh, very good. Looks like he's moving very quickly. Do you see the wind in his, his uh, coat and his hair is flying back? Looks like he's moving very quickly. Well, let's find out what that's all about. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. Well, boys and girls, let's find out what Jesus is doing. Let's get started. So as I mentioned, it's the fourth Sunday of the year. God's good news. And our gospel today is from the book of Luke. Jesus began to read the words of the prophet Isaiah to the people in the temple. The spirit of God is with me, and he has sent me to bring the good news to the poor. I have come to bring freedom and to show people a new way. And after Jesus had finished reading from the scriptures, he looked up at the crowd who were listening and said, everything you have heard is coming true today. For I have been sent to bring the good news to the world. The crowd got very angry when they heard this. Surely this is the son of Joseph, the carpenter. He has no right to say such things. Then they dragged him out to, of the temple and away from the town. But Jesus slipped away before they could do him any harm. And as we saw in the picture, Jesus looks like he's moving very quickly. He's running. Jesus grew up in Jerusalem and he had a dad who was a carpenter. And do you know what a carpenter does? Right, he builds things. And his mom, Mary, they weren't, they were just ordinary people. People had trouble believing that what Jesus said, Jesus said, he's the son of God. They were thinking that he was wrong. They wouldn't believe him. So they were chasing him away. See, here's a picture of Jesus, the son of God. And who was he? Was a carpenter? These are all the tools a carpenter used. But was he just a carpenter's son? No, you and I know he is the son of God. He humbled himself to be born of Mary and he had Joseph as a father. But he just wasn't the son of a carpenter. He is God, was God, it will always be God. And so we have a job to do, right? We have a job to do to remember that Jesus is God and he came on earth. He loved us so much. He came on earth as a little baby we just celebrated his birthday at Christmas. And then we're gonna be talking about how when he grew up as a man, he spent three years going around loving people, teaching people, curing people of their sickness and making them all better and telling them how to live, how to love God, how to love themselves and love others. Yes, and then he made the big sacrifice and died on the cross for you and me. So open up the gates of heaven so so amazing so you're going to have this picture in the word document mom and dad can print it off and you can color it and share how the story how jesus was just he was born the son of a man who was a carpenter someone who works with tools and mary was his mom but who he really was he was both like a person like you and me but he's also god have a wonderful week and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye for now.